Let's study how to identify acids and bases using red litmus solution, blue litmus solution, phenolphthalein and methyl orange indicators. We have taken an acid solution in four different watch glasses. Put red litmus solution indicator in a first watch glass and observe. Does it change the color of acid? We see that there is no color change of acid. Add blue litmus solution indicator to a second watch glass and observe. We see the color of acid changes to pink. Put phenolphthalein indicator to third watch glass. We can observe that there is no change in color. Now, add methyl orange indicator in a fourth watch glass. We see that the color of the solution changes to red. We have observed that the blue litmus solution changes the color of acid to red and methyl orange changes the color to red, whereas red litmus and phenolphthalein doesn't. We have taken a base solution in four different watch glasses. Put red litmus solution, blue litmus solution, phenolphthalein and methyl orange indicators in first, second, third and fourth watch glass respectively and observe the change in base solution color. The solution of first, third and fourth watch glass changes its color to blue, pink and yellow upon adding red litmus solution, phenolphthalein indicators and methyl orange respectively. We have observed that red litmus, phenolphthalein and methyl orange changes the base solution's color whereas blue litmus doesn't. We can conclude that solution that changes its color by adding blue litmus solution to red color and methyl orange to red color is acid. The solution which changes its color on adding red litmus solution, phenolphthalein and methyl orange to blue, pink and yellow color respectively is base. This is how we can identify acid and base solutions using indicators. Download Spark Learning app.